Yemei Svira originally were days of great simcha. The Ramban writes, Ramban al that the days from Pesach Adat Seres are like the days Mechag Adat Seres. And just like the days between Chag, Sukkot, and Shemini Yetzir Sachol HaMoyed, Yemei Svira originally were days of Gevaldige Simcha. But that's a Simcha Shenefach Liyogoyin with the tragedy of 24,000 Talmidim of Rebbe Kiva Shemesu Ben Pesach Latzeres, Meshum Shaloi Nahagu Kovoid Zeh Bezeh. And everybody asks, why such a terrible decree, such a terrible punishment? Is that a chi of Kores? Or Misa B'day Shemayim? An entire generation of Talmidah Chachumim perished? And why? They weren't noya kavod zeh bezeh. Is that one of the most <coughs> horrible avedas? And I think maybe it is because they were talmidim of Rebbe Kiva. Because to be a talmid of Adam Godel is not only a privilege. It's not only a schus. It's a tremendous responsibility. So my great Rebbe, the Kloisim Rebbe, used to say, and I heard this from him many times. And he told a story, one of my earliest recollections, he said, I was sitting in my father's lap, and the father of the Kloiz Magareb was the Rudnikarov, and he was a grandson of the Divrechaim. And my father was crying. And as a little boy, he asked him, Abba, Tati, why are you crying? And he says, I'm a can of you, I envy you. I was perplexed. And he said, Father, you envy me. You're a great Rebbe. You have a lot of Hasidim. I'm a little boy. I envy you. And my father responded and he said, I envy you because you never saw the Divrei Chaim. And I was even more baffled. And I asked him, Tata, once again, I should envy you because you had the schus of being Mishamesh at Divrei Chaim, the Tzanzerov. And my father said, Zalman Leib, you never saw the Divrei Chaim. So after 120, what could they expect of you? But I will be asked, you are Mishamesh the Divrei Chaim, and this is who you are? What did you learn from the Divrei Chaim? And my father was crying. So I feel those Talmidim were asked from the heavens by HaKadosh Baruch Hu, are you Talmidim of Rebbe Kiva? Where were you? When Rebbe Kiva said, Yerushalmi nedorem daf lamed, v'yahavtu reyacho kamoichu zeklot norum betoiro. And did you ever hear Rebbe Kiva in Pere Gimel Masechet Tovis, Chov avodem shenivro betzele merakim, chibi yaseir anay das leila odem shenivro betzele merakim? And where exactly were you when Rebbe Kiva responded to Shemen ho amsoini, and he said, Eis Hashem alakecho tiro le rabo is talmidah chachomim. You claim to meet a talmidah of Rebbe Kiva and you learn nothing from him. What exactly did you learn from your great Rebbe, Rebbe Kiva? And that is why they perished. Because they were talmidah of Rebbe Kiva. And Amin Chasos and Sichas I made a fascinating comment. So the story of this tragedy is told in Yevomist of Samach Beis. Yud Beis Elef Zugois Talmidem, Hoyla Rebbe Kiva, Vakula Meisu Ben Pesach Latzeres, Shaloi Nagu Kovoid Zeh Bezeh, Vahoyu Hu Olam Shomeim, and the world was barren. Ad Shabor Rebbe Kiva, Etzel Rebbe Senu Shabedoroim, Vishonu Lehem. Umehem Yotzu Toiro. 24,000 Talmidem, we know nothing about them. We don't even know who they were. Five Talmidim. And those five Talmidim are Kol HaToyra Kulo. So who remembers who were those five Talmidim? Reb Meir Balanes. Reb Yudu Bariloi. Reb Yossi Ben Chalafta. Reb Shema Bayechoi. Reb Aloza Ben Shemua. 90% of Mishnayis are these five Talmidim. Rabbi Yehuda, Rabbi Shimon, Rabbi Yossi, 
רב מאיר, אין רב אלוזו. סתם רב אלוזו, איזה רב אלוזו בן שמוע. אין עשה נדם פה ואוב וגמור עשה סתם משנה רב מאיר, סתם ברייס רב יהודה, ספרו ספרי, איז רב שמן, רב נחמיה, אין עם קהלס רבו פרק ה' רב נחמיה, זה עושה עוד הליסט אבל רבי סיינו שבדורם. משנה ברייסה, ספרו ספרי, דאץ כל התורה כולו. הבבלי ירושלמי, מי הקומנטרי. So why would those תלמידים זייכה? התבוננתי בדברי חז"ל, and I saw that those five תלמידים, each of them was a paragon in אהב אסריהם and כבוד חבירם. רב מאיר עשה זה מדרש, כל המבורכס יסור כאילו מבורכס השכינו. רבי יהודה says, המקבל פני חברו כמקבל פני השכינו. Those are the תלמידים. But that is the echo of רבי קיבא, חובב אודם שנברו בצלם אלוהיקים. And that is why המבורכס יסור, מבורכס השכינו. מקבל פני חברו כמקבל פני השכינו. Who is the one that says, No yechle la odem shiya palasats mo lekif shen awesh va'al yalbem pnei chaveroi berabim. Who remembers? Who is the mora de shmaitze? Reb Shimon ba yechoyim broches mem gimel. Does that teach us something about kvoid chaveroim? And who said, Yodeya ani ba'atz mi she'eni koyin. Im yoymiru le chaveroi alei le duchan o yisi oila, מיום היא לא עברתי על דברי חבריי. Who said that? Who? Is that a guess? Because we don't have many left. That's a ביוסי בן חלפתא, אין שבס קי"ח. And that was the easy one. Who said, כבוי תחוויכו כמוי רבכו, ולאוילים יהיה כבוי תלמידכו חובב הולכו. Who's left? רבי אלוזה בן שמוע, מסכת אוריס. רבי סיינו שבדור הם דלאס תלמידם אב רבי קיבא. They learned from רבי קיבא. They were his real תלמידם. Not only לומדס, but תורס חיים ויהבס חסד. They learned from רבי קיבא, that's why they were זייכה. כל התורה כולה that we learn is the תורה of רבי סיינו שבדור הם. the later Talmidim of Rabbi Kiva, because they were mechaved one another. So it's almost like Bohemia. And the Shulchan Aruch writes, Tov Tzadik Gimel, Lag Bohemia noeg im kitsa simcho, mepnei sh'oimrim, sh'posko ha-magaifo. Interesting Roshan. People say, posko ha-magaifo. And I guess, why? So the level Yor, Rabbi Yor Apian, quotes Rabbi Sol Salanta. There's a kesha between Mem Chesvorim Shatoi Re Nikneis Bohem and Mem Tes Yemei Asvira. Chidush Arim says the same. And the Chidush Arim demanded from his Chassidim and Rabbi Sol from his Talmidim to be practical. Every... <coughs> Every day, me and my you work on one of the Kenyon Eitoira, and you go from one step to another. So if you take out a Mishnayis, and you count, Memchaz Borom Shatoira Niknes Bem, number 32 is Oyev Esabriyos. Libi Yoimeli. What Rabbi Suhan Salanta knew, and what the Chidush Arim knew, probably Rabbi Kiva knew as well. And probably Rabbi Kiva taught his Talmidim. Every day you work on one of the Kenyone Taira. And on day 32, Lamed Beis La'oyma, Lamed Beis is Leiv, Ki Ish Echod U Beleiv Echod. Day 32, they worked on Oive Sabriris. Day 33, Lagba Oyma, the plague was over. The Pasko Lamas. And that is why Lagba Oyma Noyagin we have to recognize the Kal Godel Betoyer. 
We need to support each other, love each other. And not only in the abstract way. It's very easy for a person to say, you know, I love everybody. You need to prove it. It needs to be obvious. And whatever you would like others to do for you, go out of your way and do to others. That is the mitzvah of Yerotzen Shechel Kedem Wimorim.